Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For this video, we're going to be doing something really fun and we're going to be putting Diva Curl's new product, Diva Fresh, to the test. Diva Fresh is Diva Curl's new scalp and curl vitalizer infused with kombucha and prickly pear so that it can keep your curls looking and feeling fresh for 24 hours. It's going to help with definition, moisture, and volume while soothing the scalp and fighting frizz. Usually by day five, my hair has already been up in a bun or I've started to try to play around with different styles. So my goal is to be able to wear my hair down and see if I can keep it looking good all throughout the week before my next wash. I washed my hair three days ago using my current summer routine from Diva Curl and I'm going to have a link to the video up in the corner for you guys so you can see exactly what I did. The only thing I did different from that video was before I started diffusing I just went in and scrunched in a little bit more, set it free and ultra defining gel. Day one was just a really relaxing day. After I finished washing my hair, I just laid outside and tanned for a little bit and then just watched TV, I'm not gonna lie. So I didn't really need Diva Fresh. Day two, however, I went ahead and caught up on my workout because I don't like to get behind. So I got sweaty because it was hot. I got done with my workout today. It wasn't a long workout, but it's hot outside. I live in North Carolina, so I still got really sweaty at the scalp. Don't want to take a shower with my hair the same way that I had it when I worked out. So I just wanted to quick show you before I get in the shower, I am just going to take my hair out of that. Oh yeah, and like I said, it feels a little wet at the scalp. So what I'm going to do is before I get in the shower, I'm going to go in with Diva Fresh and just give myself like a couple quick squirts and then I am now going to take my shower the way I would and I'm going to plop my hair into my reusable shower cap. So I will be back after I take a shower and do my makeup and we'll check in. After I took my shower and did my makeup, I really liked the way my curls were looking and I started to notice that the Diva Fresh was giving me some volume. So I went ahead and added some more, especially at my roots so I didn't smell sweaty later on. And then I went in with my pick and just fluffed at my roots for even more volume because you guys know I love volume. You better go bye bye. Say bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. We're gonna go eat eat. Then we're gonna go eat eat. And at the end of day two, after keeping my hair down all day in the humidity in North Carolina, as you see, my curls were still looking pretty good. My goal for this video was to also only use Diva Fresh throughout the week to see if I could use it to just reactivate the products that I used on my original wash day. So for day three, after doing my makeup and taking a shower, I just went in and followed my same steps using the Diva Fresh. Now we are on day three. I have already been up. I refreshed my hair with Diva Fresh and I'm getting ready to head out. It is 93 degrees outside today. I'll be checking back in with you guys tonight just to show you how my hair looks after day three. Checking in now, it is 7.01, still July 11th. We're about to go bowling now. We've been out all day. I got my nails done. I feel like my hair looks really, really good. I've kept it down all day. Usually by now, with it being so hot, I have put it up. But I can definitely say that putting the Diva Fresh on before I left was a good idea. The key with it is holding it a good distance away and just squirting like once or twice per section. Like, don't overdo it. Look at that volume. So, yep, yeah. so now it's bowling time. Finally, we chose coming to the bowling alley the night that all the leagues are here. So we're gonna have to plan that for tomorrow. Getting a rain check. <laughs> and now we are now at the end of day three. It is now 11, oh, it is now 11.35. So I just wanted to check in. I'm super sleepy. So I'm about to put my hair up, do my, well, do my scalp massage, put my hair up. So I'll be checking in tomorrow for day four of putting Diva Fresh to the test. Twelve, twelve fifteen. Well, I, I, it, <laughs> I'm alive. <laughs> it's 12.57. So here we are. It is July 12th, 12.57. I woke up, massaged my scalp, did nothing to my hair. I haven't had added any product, anything. I just woke up, massaged my scalp, 
We went to Lowe's to get some paint. So I just wanted to give you guys a check-in. This was my end of day four check-in. I wanted to show you how my hair was holding up without using any products other than Diva Fresh. And I also wanted to show you how I was sleeping with my hair throughout this video so that you would know how I was preserving my curls. around 640 still on day five as you saw we were outside working on the pool all day I probably wasn't doing as much work as my brothers and my husband but yeah it was hot outside humid we ended up getting rained on so I went ahead I was feeling icky so I went ahead and took a shower put on just a little bit of makeup for you guys and now I am going to use Diva Fresh and show you how I am going to refresh for day five. As I said, we did get rained on a little bit, so I am going to be just hitting my hair with the diffuser just real quick after I spritz my roots with a little bit of Diva Fresh, just like we've been doing. I actually think getting a little wet in the rain might have helped, but, but I still, you guys know I like volume and wet hair it's gonna be way down, so I'm still going to hit it with the diffuser. I do my makeup. I know that my hair gets like a little ashy around my edges, so I'm just gonna take a few squirts. For about five minutes, I am now going to diffuse alternating the medium temperature and the cool temperature, just like I always do, just to quick refresh my hair, dry it because I don't want my hair to be wet. And yeah. I'm going to just scrunch in a little bit of high shine just in the areas, especially in this back area. And I honestly feel like I could go to day six, but because of my highlights, I don't want to go too long without adding in some intense moisture. So I'll be cleansing with no poo tonight or tomorrow morning. And then I plan on mixing the Decadence One Condition and Heaven and Hair together for a nice, intense, deep treatment. So I feel like if I didn't have the highlights, I could go, who knows, maybe even a full seven days without having to wash my hair. One thing I tell people is I usually know it's time to wash my hair when I start to lose bounce and movement and I still have lots of movement so all right you guys that's it for this video i hope you enjoyed it it's my first time doing anything like this kind of vlogish so let me know if you want to see anything more like this give me some ideas down below in the comments if you guys want to get your hands on the new diva curl diva fresh i have my affiliate link down below so you guys can go ahead and head over to the diva curl site and get your hands on this i had lots of fun putting diva fresh to the test and you guys should definitely put it to the test too. Use Diva Curl's hashtag fresh to the test and let them see all the different ways that you're testing it out. And of course, tag me so I can see results too. All right, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe and don't miss my next video. Bye.